Hi, it's Hillary Topper here, and I'm from HJMT Public Relations. I'm also your host of Tech News Now. And my guest today is Christoph Mueller, who's with Warmex, and he's here to talk about a new product that he just developed that is wearable underwear. Check it out. So where is the heat coming from? Yeah, you have a small device, that one connected with push buttons. And this is our controller. Uh, there's a lithium ion accumulator inside. Mm. Very strong one. And up here we have more than 100 components. Um, um, under them is a microprocessor controller with a lot of uh, software programmed on it. And uh, this device is measuring the resistance all the time. And um, by that it is able to regulate the power. Because the problem is, you have a knitted current circuit. Mm -hmm. yeah. Ah. In the area, yeah, it's getting warm. Mm -hmm. And um, the problem is, a knitted circuit is not stable. It's flexible. Right. So it'll know when you get too hot, it will regulate? Yeah. So normally, if you would have only a, a battery, and a switch, or an off switch. Uh -huh. um, it might be that it's getting too hot, or even it's getting not that hot. It mm. depends on the resistance, and that is changing with every move I make, you know? So the heat output would differ. And this controller is able to guard that and regulate it and provide a constant heat output, no matter what you do, it's wet or uh, you move. So if this gets wet, uh, does it damage or? No, you, you can make this wet while working, it's mm. no problem. Mm. Let me ask you something. So if you use this, I mean, I could see so many different possibilities for so many different sports, you know, including skiing and hiking and that type of thing. Say I'm using this for running. I have a shirt. What Do you have um, long Yeah, we have pants. Pants. Yeah. Okay, so I, I, I wear the whole body outfit for running. Um, running, it's... 10 degrees outside, is it really going to keep me warm? Um, we are only able to warm certain zones. Uh, it's not possible to warm up the complete garment. Okay. Uh, basically, it would be possible. Uh, from our side, as a apparel manufacturer, it's not a problem. I can knit a current circuit that warms everything. Right. But you need a car battery to drive that. Oh. And, uh, That's not big enough. Nope. So where? what are the actual areas in which it heats up? This shirt is called Silver Sun, and this shirt warms up the kidney area. Ah. These, these so it's just back here? Yeah, these two. Interesting. Uh, uh, yeah. And and if, and let me, oh, it's interesting because it's, it's flat, and it's, it feels very nice. It's a very soft fabric. It's not itchy. It's a That's it. very... That's why we took this um, silver-coated polyamide fiber for hmm. conducting. Interesting. And by the way, the arms, uh, it has no function. It's just for design. The uh, functional ah. part is just around the waist. I guess it's necessary to have a, an insulating outerwear. Yeah, Something that prevents the warmth from... So skin. let me ask you something. How can somebody buy these products? Uh, the most easy way to do that is to go on warmex.com. Okay. Uh, 